All right. Let's see how we can actually use drill in MapR. So I have a VM that runs MapR. So it's a one node cluster. So I have my MCS that shows the node. So, so before I go dive in, I just want to make sure um, whether the drill is driving or running on this cluster. So if you go to MCS and then you can actually see the drill bit is actually running. And if you want to make sure, so that drill port is listening. So the port that MapR drill runs is 8047. So from here, it actually listens. So it's listening. So let's go on to my 8047. Yeah. So right now, what we got is the drill home page and it is an admin panel as you can see it got uh, tabs like threads metrics and storage plugins um, I'll call storage plugin in my next video let's see how we can actually use this to query data so let's see what data I have in my cluster so I have a finance volume let's see what I have in my finance volume Right, so there is a JSON file that's sitting in my finance volume. Um, let's try to query this file, okay? Zips.json. All right. So, so to do that, so you do select star from. So if you are accessing from the distributed file system, you do DFS dot, um, and there is this um, apostrophe, and then you specify where the data is so it's finance slash sorry slash gyps dot json and then and then i just want to limit to 20. so right now you can actually see you're able to query the json file without having to define any schema okay so let's look at um so it got state so let's look at what is the distinct state we have distinct state okay All right, let's run this query so we have lots of states so i'll just take new york I'll just do select star, then I'll put a where class where state equals and why. Then I want to limit to 200 records. So right now it actually pulls all the data that got New York. Okay, so you can actually go and explore. All right, that's that's drill for you. So there is something called a storage plugin and then right now I've just enabled the hive storage plugin. Let's see whether we can actually access any, so I'll just do show databases. Um, yeah, okay, I don't have any files in my hive, um, tables or databases in hive. So at the moment I just have only this file system. 